the guy on Jeopardy lost. And jo- I'm, uh, uh, what's his name? Holzhauer. Yeah, James Hausenhauer. No, Holzhauer. J- James Holzenfauer. <laughs> Hausenfauer. Hausenfauer. <laughs> James Hasselhoff. <laughs> so, uh, first of all, Richard's such a weirdo. Richard Christie, who works for us, he cried when the guy lost. <sighs> He's got problems. He's so weird. He doesn't know this man. Will came to me and he said, Richard's going around scratching his bald head and he's like making a hole in it. And then it turns out (laughs) Richard had a spider crawling on him and thought it would be interesting to see the spider crawl on him. And then he lost track of the spider. And now he goes, I know the spider's not on my head, but I keep feeling like it is. And I keep scratching my head. First of all, A, he was crying during Jeopardy. And B, he allowed a spider to crawl on him. Tell that story. Uh, last night, a spider was crawling across my shirt. And, and, you, I just, and you were like, hey, I just want him to crawl on me for a while. Yeah, I didn't bother him. I was just kind of looking at it. I was like, oh, I'm not man. scared of spiders. I am. I would have freaked out. And then it just crawled, it went inside my shirt, and then I couldn't find it. And now you think it's on your head. Uh, it's probably in my mind that I'm like now a little weirded like out you're about feeling, it. Why didn't you just shower and get rid of the whole... Oh, no, that would be too easy. I huh. will eventually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're scratching your head again. Yeah. Because you feel the spider on you. I'm, it's in my mind, I imagine, but it could be on me still. Are you sure it was a real spider? Yeah, it was definitely real. Yeah. But How big a spider? It's probably eating the other bugs that are on me, so that's good. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, it's really weird. It's <laughs> like such a, a good food source. It's like you're in a horror movie. And why did you cry when the guy on Jeopardy Oh, lost? my God. My wife and I both, we were wow, like... you guys found each other. Oh, we love James. Like, he's like the freaking Michael Jordan of Jeopardy. And Yeah, but he's not, because he didn't get the he record. He didn't get the record. 70,000 shots. Tell well, Robin so your... Ken Jennings is the Michael Jordan. He's the LeBron. Then. Yeah, but but tell Robin your theory. See, everyone's running around with a theory about this guy, and I just think he lost... This is a guy who watches bugs crawl across his shirt. I know, but... Do I care about his theories? <laughs> <laughs> There's so many things that ran through my head because it's like so weird that he would lose right before he beat Ken Jennings. You were the one who put out the theory that he didn't want to beat Ken Jennings. I might have. Yeah. I might have. You don't remember that? <laughs> so many things no, have gone well, through his mind, including a spider. Exactly. I hear a, I hear a new theory every second, and I'm like, okay, that could be true. But What is it, Gary? This morning in our meeting, you said... He wanted to lose because he was tired and he didn't want to beat Ken Jennings' record. <laughs> what? Well, no, I said <laughs> I had heard people say that it, that maybe he was tired and wanted to go home. And well, said, John, well, maybe he could be. Oh, yeah. so you what just take... people said that, Richard? On the internet. Oh, there's... Oh, oh there's... my God, there's so many theories. John yeah. Hines' theory, though. John Hines has a theory, too. Yeah, yeah, I know, he has a I know theory. He's just watch TV. You gotta have a theory. That... <laughs> Jeopardy rigged it so that they knew that this woman was a really excellent player. Yes. So they held her back from playing until right until this guy was about to beat Ken Jennings. Why record. don't they want him to beat Ken Jennings? What is their attachment to Ken? Uh, yes, John, this is a fucking nutty theory. <laughs> My thought is that when it got to the Ken Jennings money thing, they would put him up against the best contestant they had and think, okay, if he beats her, then he, he deserves, deserves it. it. Yeah. When you look at her... 27-year-old librarian wrote a master's thesis on Jeopardy and why the clues are in certain places. They knew she was going to be really, really good. And so I don't think it was fixed that he was going to lose, but I do think they said, all right, we're going to put up our best against him to see if he could break the record. Well, that makes more sense than anything else I've heard. I had heard, too, that some of the Jeopardy writers like weren't happy with the way James played because he wouldn't go in the well, right order. Well, she didn't play that way either. She well, took his tactics yeah. and played against him. Well, yeah, his that, way. They say a lot of people from now on are going to play and James' way. And she found wife. two of the Daily Doubles. He only got one. Hey, guess who's on the phone, guys? The spider in Richard's brain. Ooh. <laughs> I found his ear and I went inside. Oh, so he went in through your ear and now he's in your head. <laughs> I'm going to lay my eggs. It's the perfect spot. He's got nothing going on. <laughs> 